What FBN does is it aggregates anonymously millions of acres, 130 million acres of data that we've put in from everything from planting files, application records, to yield files. And then we match that up seed by soil, by population, and all these other variables. So what we can actually show you is what are the highest yielding seeds in Michigan, corn, beans, or any other crop. Um, and for your specific set of soils on every field, which seeds are going to get you the highest overall performance based on not what the company's telling you or the retailer's telling you or even just what the university is able to look at, but based on the whole market and what's actually working on those soils on other farms in the system. And what we found is that that yield data is worth six bushels an acre on average when you pick that highest performing seed from FBN. When you build a good network around you of a lot of other growers in FBN, it jumps to 17 bushels an acre. That's simply because we're scanning more seeds and we're finding the better and better matches between seed genetics and soil type. So that's worth a lot of money. Number two, what we started doing this year is doing relabeling intelligence. So about 40% of corn seeds, 47% of soybean seeds on the market are being sold by multiple companies. Farmers have been in the dark about this because they haven't been able to identify when two seeds were the same. Uh, they knew it took place, but they couldn't identify it. We cross-matched every seed on the market. We can show you exactly which seeds are um, the same as each other. Growers are reporting savings of $40 a bag, $50 a bag, when they can take one seed that they were purchasing or interested in, find the lower cost provider, it's the same genetics, and they're able to go out and switch their purchase. So that's real money back to the farm. That's you know, 10, 15, 20 bucks an acre. Highest farm savings we found there was $97 a bag between two seeds that were identical in the same state. Um, that's $30 an acre just going back to the seed label, not even saying buy a different seed or use a different population. It's a lot of money back to the farm. FBN is a network now of over 6,000 farms, 22 million acres of growers across the U.S. and Canada. Um, what's remarkable about that is we started from scratch four years ago and really didn't launch the company until 2015. And because of the network and creating a network that is farmers first, that uh, just focuses on bringing dollars back to the farm through information, uh, through better contracts, through better input purchasing, through price transparency, um, we've been able to uh, you know, drive a lot of value back to growers all across the U.S. And that's been at the, the core of you know, why we've grown. Um, we're bringing dollars back to the farm. And I think it took us about 16 months to get to the first 500 members of FBN as that network grew and folks invited their friends. And, and then it took us, uh, in January, we grew by over 500 farms in one month. And that was no, now over 2 million acres in January. So I think it took us, yeah, about 14 months or so to get to that first million acres. We grew by that uh, 2 million acre mark in just one month. The reason that matters is because FBN's a network. And every grower that joins FBN makes the system smarter. So it learns, it gets better at seed selection, it gets better at more price intelligence for everyone. And then we also get more pricing power. We get the ability to go out and negotiate, get better volumes on our inputs that our growers can buy. And so we can pass on those savings back to the membership by driving prices down and down. And that's what we've been able to do. There are some products, some chemicals, for example, like Callisto, we're able to drive the price of that 80, 70% down from what some of our growers are paying. So you're able to get enormous savings that, that the network can pass through. And that's what's called a network effect. And a network effect just means each new person that joins the system makes the system more valuable for every other person. And that's, that's what we are. We're a network of growers and their data and their commerce.